Hello, this is RPGLPs, and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy III! Alright, since last time, I did a little bit of level grinding. I got everybody up to level 37. Yeah, Refia died as I was level grinding. Well, so she'll be behind when everybody gains a level. She, she'll uh, be still 37. So, okay. Also, I sold everything I wanted to off-screen. And now we're at the southern tip of Salonia Continent. And we want to head south from here. We actually want to go back to the floating continent where we originally started. And here it is. There's this little lone island, I guess you can call it that. Hopefully we... Did we land in the right place? Uh, yes we did. Okay. Yeah, remember this from way long ago? You remember seeing that whatever that monster is in the lake. This is Lake Dahl, and we actually want to go here. I already rested up off-screen. So, okay. You just want to head into the monster here. And we enter into Lake Dahl. Now, this is the reason I wanted to do a little bit of level grinding. This place is really hard. Especially these guys, Plank Tays. Yeah, they can put you to sleep and it is deadly here. I mean, they do massive damage to people. And crap, see, they're already putting me to sleep. Yeah, they have fairly low HP, but I mean, they hit for ridiculous amounts of damage. Even at my levels. I mean, I guess it is possible if you were level 34, 35, it would still be a hell of a challenge though. And, what, there's a... Yeah, there's only three more new enemies. And some treasure we can get here. Let's go ahead and grab that. Nothing I really care about. God's Rage. And an Earth Drum that I'll be selling off. Okay, here's another new enemy. Ouroboros. Ouroboros. I have no idea how, how the hell you pronounce that. But yeah, pretty much on the regular enemies, we just want to be using uh, Quake. We want to save our level 3 elemental spells for later. So yeah, that's pretty much the way to go. Quake does a lot of damage to these guys. High potion. Oh, I was about to say, if they're all high potions, what the heck? But no, we got an elixir. All right. And here's another new enemy, a sea lion. These guys are easy. Um, yeah, we'll go with arrow too. Why not? Help add some skill levels too. Look at that damage though. On Lunath and Ark. Yeah, could you imagine if they could put you to sleep too and do that damage? Holy cow. Oh, they didn't kill him? Huh. Okay, let's uh, quick heal up here. Cure 2 ought to do it. No, actually. Go ahead and heal everybody up. There we go. Okay, now we want to head up first. White Sun? I don't know what the hell that does. Yeah, I got ambushed there and Ark died. <laughs> we're getting an Aegis Shield. Got a God's Wine. And a Turtle Shell. Alright. Not that I really care about it. Okay. Now let's head down here. And we made it to the floor, the third floor. Okay, I believe we want to head... Yeah. We want to head down here first. Impshion and a Lilith Kiss. Okay, now before heading down the, that staircase there, let's head up here. And what do we got here? We got a Black Hole, Four Hammer, and a Reflect Mail. And a Dark Scent. Okay, let's make our way back to that staircase now. 
Come on. I'm getting into, like, the worst encounters here. I've gotten, like, five ambushes. It's ridiculous. Okay, we made it to the fourth and final floor. Hey, I wonder who that guy is. Okay, here's another new enemy, a Remora. Uh, nothing special about this guy. Yeah, as you can see, look at how much damage I've been taking. Yeah, in fact, I had to use all my Arrow 2 spells. Yeah, might as well use Cure 3. Got nothing better to do. We finish him off. Alright. Easy enough, and that's the last of the new enemies. So let's go ahead and find out what this guy is up to. Actually, yeah. I'm going to take a second, heal up, and be right back. Okay, we're all healed up and ready to go. Let's go ahead and talk to this guy. He is Leviathan. He shall lend, the pow lend us the power to those with the light. Are we worthy enough? For boss time against Leviathan himself. Now this guy has around 7,000 HP. Uh, he's fairly tough. He has a pretty devastating attack. Let's go ahead and use Bolt 3 on him. I don't believe he's actually weak to lightning. Oddly enough, I mean, you'd think he is. But yeah, he has a devastating attack called Tsunami. And if you've ever played Final Fantasy IV, you remember that guy, that boss. Yeah, what was this? The, what was the Mist Dragon? It was that octopus guy. Look at how much damage this is. Or no, it was... Yeah, it was the... Uh, Eidolon, right? With Rydia. It was, uh, Leviathan himself, actually. Uh, yeah. Ark's really gonna be taking the brunt of the damage here. As you can see, it's probably gonna do, like, 700, 800 damage to him. Yeah, 837. Hopefully Ark can survive. I really need him to. Yeah, he should be able to survive at least two more. Hopefully. And hopefully Ingus gets Cure 4 off before Tsunami goes off. Yeah, and if you did have an extra Hay spell, you could go ahead and use that on Lunath. I don't think that's necessary, though. We can get him easily enough. And all right, we got him. And we only get 1250 experience. Okay, and we obtained the Leviathan Summon. Not that I'm really ever going to be using it. But, alright. Let's go ahead and warp on out of here. Yeah, I saved one exit spell just for this, viewers. Yeah, now we slain Leviathan. Okay, we're all healed up and ready to go. I sold off all the excess gear off screen. So let's go ahead and get the hell out of here. And head to the next area. Sadly, we won't have time to go through the next area today. But we'll be doing that tomorrow. Actually, yeah, I want to go down here first. Yeah, and we're actually right next to the place. There it is. That's the cave we want to head into. So we'll just circle around here. And hop over here. Now, this is absolutely critical you have to be well you don't have to be but you want to be at least 36 or above i'm at 38 i'd really like to get up to geez at least uh 39 40 by the end of this place also when we go through here at the very end of it we cannot cast exit so make sure you have some spells some cure spells and uh yeah it wouldn't be a bad idea to go ahead and get cure 2 for arc I don't think that's necessary, not for right now. And yeah. Okay, let's head in here to the Cave of Bahamut. I'll do a little bit of it today. And I don't believe this is a new enemy, a grenade. I'm pretty sure we fought him before. Uh, either that or a pallet swap, their cousin. Let's go ahead and cast Bio on the one in the back. And Arrow. 
Now we want to also make sure to save a couple haste spells for the very end. Because you guessed it, take a wild guess who's waiting at the end of this cave, viewers. It's not really a spoiler, but holy cow. Yeah, that can happen. And there's nothing I can do about it. Tw what is it? What was it? 2,500 damage? And that's probably the, the last character I'd want uh, to get killed. We really need Ingus to be alive here. And look at a God's Rage and an Earth Drum. Ah, oh, crap. Yeah. Luckily, I have Phoenix down. But that's all time I have for this episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy 3! This is RPGLPs, heading out. I'll see you next time!